I'm AK-47, leader of Art Qaeda, an art terrorist organization. We don't actually go around killing people. We bomb it with art, spray paint, graffiti. The reason I'm pissed off with Banksy is he refused to sign my fucking print. What I love about Banksy is that he thinks about the message he puts out to the public. It seems like the elusive Banksy has struck again. Called the drinker, it was installed overnight here in central London. Who is going to move an extremely heavy statue on a plinth? Ding, ding, ding. We're going to hold one of Banksy's works to ransom. It was planned like very precise. They just rolled up, acting as if they were commissioned to actually be there. I mean, that is absolutely priceless. So he doesn't know where he's going. <laughs> we're kidnapping him. Suddenly, people knew this name, AK-47. I was a hero. <laughs> Especially Banksy. Yeah, it's true. Uh, it had gone. I received a ransom letter. Said I'll take five grand for it. And I said I was willing to give him two pounds towards a can of petrol. I didn't realise then I was opening a fucking Pandora's box. Three to six months later. Horror. Stolen. What? <laughs> It took me 30 seconds to work out all oh, what why. I don't know whether Banksy had it stolen back or not, but the word is him or his people did. <laughs> you have to get to know Andy really, really well to understand who he is. He's not going to give up. He's just relentless. Because he's a madman. <laughs> what is the one thing Banksy would not expect me to do? He is an artist to some extent. We're all artists. He just happens to be a piss artist. Phoenix from the flames. It's going to rise again, and I'm going to rub it right in his fucking face.